Russell. Now, commencing with Monday, Anne Edwards, fashion expert of woman, shows all our girls how to make one frock do for every day. Why not start off a busy week with a dainty collar of flowers made of ribbon or tape? Maybe there's a lunch date in the offing. To go with it is a little collar made from a square of lace with a hole in the middle for that swan-like neck. If you're a bit tired of the dress as a dress, you can turn it into a suit with the help of a little bodice front and a jacket. Off with the jacket, and it's your old frock in another new and attractive guise. Thursday may be your half day. When you meet the boyfriend, he won't recognize the old frock when it's all dressed up with a front made out of an old blouse. Looks like a completely new outfit, doesn't it? Going away this weekend, then we'll give that frock a fresh look with new revers turned back from the throat. The transformation is as simple as it's effective. Off for a hike or a bike through the country, huh? Well, that same old frock turns up once more, looking as sporty as a hunting pink with its woolen waistcoat and stiff cravat. None of these little extras is too ambitious or too expensive. And what a difference they make. If this is the day when Lancelot or Montmorency comes round to tea, you'll probably want to give the impression that you've put on a new frock especially for him. So on goes the full-length apron front, cut out of the good pieces of a shabby frock. Now, what about a little walk in the garden?